What's up, people? I'm Bilal, and welcome back to Starfield for episode 34. So the last episode, uh, we picked up a new quest, uh, Failure to Communicate, it's called, uh, where we went to Olympus and met this guy, Alban Lopez, who is from a third faction, not the UC, not the Free Star Rangers, but I think it's called List or something, the Liberated Individuals or something of... Uh, of space i don't don't ask me uh in any case so these guys were having space troubles and four of their satellites were down uh we had some very struggly uh ship fights in the last episode um and yeah we got through two of them and i ran out of ship parts and now i've headed all the way back to neon i uh in between uh, episodes i picked up ship parts you can find them at newell's goods at Sigard. And according to Google, you can find him at the Trade Authority guy as well, but I couldn't find any. Maybe he's just out at the moment. Anyway, I got a bunch of ship parts. I got over encumbered because they are 10 uh, value of mass each. And uh, then I decided to hand them over to Andresia. I'm going to do a couple of loose ends uh, on uh, Neon before we go ahead with our um, satellite quest. Um, there we go. I'm gonna sell the side star because I don't want to be paying for contraband. Handle, we can take it off your hand. Yeah, Need take it off my hands. Merch. It is this indeed is too uh, hot to handle. It's like 700 this time. I think the bounty increases every time I enter some uh, controlled um, city. So I, it's not worth it. Not a bad gun. Yeah, yeah. You'll give but me 500, right? Right. Yeah, I'll give. I'll Pleasure take 500. Pleasure doing business. And now we can go to Manaya, exactly, dirty laundry. All so, right, buzz off. Busy. <clears throat> so she should be around here somewhere as well. Um, miscellaneous, dirty laundry, return to Manaya. She's in the Astral Lounge. Let's go to the ultimate club of Neon. That's cool. So, ooh, that's a lot of people. So I did Google a couple of things. Can we craft uh, ship parts? We can't. We just have to go and buy them. We have a chance of getting them from debris from like ships that we destroy. I wasn't very lucky in the last couple of fights in the last episode. Now I have like over 10 ship parts. So I think I should be okay. Plus I should realize I shouldn't I panic press. I do admire what has built for himself here. Oh yeah. Benjamin Bayou. That's a guy we'll come across at some point. Um, yeah, I don't want to be panicking and pushing the um, repair button like five times because that uses up five ship parts and it doesn't do any good because these ship parts take time to repair the hull. I don't know, man. I'm having ship struggles again. Maybe an upgrade to the weapon system might also be a good thing. They say for every five credits Benjamin Bay you spent on Neon, four <laughs> went to the Astral Lounge. Excuse me. Um, yeah, most of, I mean, this place is pretty awesome looking, so, and Borealis is cool, the DJ. Then my anyway. client can finally relax. He's a very tense man, you see. Tried to smile once, years ago, and didn't like the fit. But I digress. Here's your payment, as promised. Enjoy the rest of your time here in Neil. Better be five, well, 3,300, okay, I'll, well. Goodbye. I'll take it, I guess. Like, oh man, that's a cool beat. <laughs> this place is definitely screenshot worthy. I mean, well done. This place is really, really cool. Nothing like some I love the whole Sanskrit thing going on with the labels. Anyway, it is time for us to head back to the satellite mission, uh, which is called uh, what again failure to communicate that's the one yeah we've got two more satellites uh for the two different families right we repaired the lopez one this was our initial contact we repaired the banda one we've got lemaire and when so these four families are part of the collective known as the list or something li something something um 
And those guys aren't uh, Free Star or uh, United Colony, so that's kind of interesting. They they tend to think they're free. I say tend to think because everybody tends to think they're free, right? Reusion would tell its employees that uh, employees are free, I guess. But that's that. So ship repaired, ship parts are in. I have to talk to Andresia, get them into the ship inventory. I also went and sold a bunch of stupid shit that was there in the ship's inventory. Um, I should also just fast travel. Um, hello. Yeah, there you go. Um, fast travel? Yeah. There we go. Forgot that I could fast travel from inside Neon as well. Always a satisfying moment. Um, I'll get ship. up. Yeah, there's also something I googled. In space, I can press and hold F or E would be the default binding uh, to get up and walk around the ship, a.k.a. get you, ma'am, to yes, give me need, all the ship me? parts. Um, heavy particle fuse. Interesting. Give me all of that, and let's... Until next time. Mm. Oh, Lynn is sleeping. Hey, Lynn. You look well. Ah, that's so typical of Bethesda. Like, the, this would happen in Oblivion and in Skyrim. Somebody's sleeping, you talk to them, and they just talk to you like normally. They're not pissed off at getting woken up. I can take it. Yeah. You actually don't have anything on you, so that's all right. I Bye. wonder what happened to any gear that I gave to Sarah. She's not in my party, so what happens to the gear? Do I have to, like, go back and, like, Get it from, get her in my party. Get it back from her. Ah. Uh, transfer, um, transfer from me. Transfer all. Transfer according to mass. The heaviest shit in the world. All right. So we're uh, not too good on our um, um, weight situation at the moment. But I don't feel like I want to just let go of anything at the moment. Like, I have a few packs here that might not be very... They might be redundant, but this is a power, balance, basic. Um, Yeah, let's put the basic one in. All right, we've got um, some room in the ship now, finally. Okay, with that said, let us take off. Severo! I didn't shout out Severo at the start of the episode to this time. Um, take off. I always like to think two times, like, because I always press the wrong button and then I end up not taking off, but getting up. All right, you guys ready for some uh, ship battles, some ship struggles? I hope I don't struggle too much. I had to, like, cut up the last episode a little bit because it was just a bit redundant. Plus, the fights aren't very exciting anyway, so. Welcome to Free Star Space. We're gonna do a quick scan for contraband, and you can be on your way. I ain't got any contraband on me anymore. Thank you very much. Um, That's all we need. Enjoy neon. I don't want to enjoy neon. Voli? No, it's Olympus we want to go to, right? Olympus, yeah, that's the one. Mission. Go. I like it. I, I like that I don't have to go to the map and select and blah, blah, blah. I can just do this. There we go. All right. We're here. This is the Algamesh, Algamist. There is the communication satellite number one. It's quite close by. It's in kilometers, not even in light seconds. And this would be the other one, which is further away. Okay. Quick save, and uh, let's do this. Spacers, here comes the frontier with its uh, not very upgraded weapons, I guess, but at least some repairability options. What? Oh, there. I was like, where, where are the dudes? Wait, what? No dudes? What's going on? Lemaire satellite is on its own? Really? You're not gonna make me fight some ships game? You're gonna be kind to me, game? 
Or are they going to show up as soon as we repair the satellite? Sorry, my Fire monitor went off. Oh, there we are. My monitor went into auto shut off mode for a second there. All right. What do you got? Okay. Thrusters up. Uh, not gonna repair hull right now. You are very close to me, man. Alright, repair hull once. Hopefully, we can also get our shield back. Yes, we're starting to get our shield back. Great. Boost away. Alright, shield recovery time is very slow at the moment, I feel. Uh, hull's going down again. Ah, damn it! Ah, well. Who'd have thunk it? <laughs> okay, so they baited us in, huh? 3,000, I mean, three kilometers away, nothing. And all of a sudden, we have like, I think there was a, some faster than light travel effects happening around us. Telling us that uh, those guys just poured it in all of a sudden. Alright, we're within 2,000 meters. Hull's looking good so far. I will put more in the day. missile, actually. Is it not my day? It might not be my day, but I'll make it my day, man. done and one repair job all right let's thrust down and yes all right man how do i like enemy missile lock on like how do i change that stuff. Like, how do I make sure that I can avoid the um, the missiles, like that they send to me? Like, do I have flares of some sort? Like, or I just have to take the damage? I don't know, man. Make short work of them. Yeah, yeah. We'll see about that. Spacer Raven. Ooh, we're right in the middle of them now. Okay, I'll put my engines all the way down and put my missiles all the way up. And shoot, shoot. Shield are done. We should be dead soon. Okay, how we go? We'll use the second time. There we go. That's one. Let's turn sharp right, left, whatever. Ah! Alright. Let's get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. That was your shield, I believe. And thrust. My engines are shot. Dude, their their guns are crazy good. There's the third one, which is still on full health. God damn it. And 
you're shooting light right at me. I have zero. Yes! Yes, that's two out of three. Gonna recover all my... I don't even have grab drive anymore. Critical hit reactor. What? Okay. We did it, but we've got some problems. Do we see damage in the ship? We see a little bit of smoke coming out of the front, but that seems harmless. I mean, I would assume that hull damage would mean like loss of pressure. Probably can't exit right now. Vasco's probably hanging out in in the the parking area, uh, whatever that's called, like the the ramp. Okay. Shield should be back online. Okay, and I want to take a look at... I can't see my cargo hold. I can. How many of these things? Oh, I used like four ship parts. Damn. Okay, uh, let's go see if we can recover any. Engines are shot. Uh, engine should be given some power. Fisher Raven gives me credit. What is that? Nope, not that. Spacer Raccoon right here. Ship parts! Two of them. Nice. Uh, those two things I don't want. Uh, but you still gave them to me, didn't you? Space of Raven. Okay, so we recovered uh, two of our whatever five ship parts that I used, which is, um, I guess it's just luck. I mean, these are just like dropped items. Ice Tropic Coolant and credits. Let's take the credits. Let's go see the Lemaire station and revive it. Or the Lemaire satellite. That is number three. Okay, the ship has repaired itself pretty much. Um, and connect. Another satellite up and broadcasting. Mm -hmm. Lopez to Lemaire. Jacqueline, are you there? Yeah, Open? Jacqueline. How the hell? I'm almost glad to hear your voice. There's something Listen, going on between them. We need to meet. All of us. These spacers have got us on the ropes. What sort of game are you playing? We're not going to fall for another of your cons. No game. No ruse. Times have changed. We need to move on or we'll all be the saddest little footnote in history. We can meet. But it'll be on my ship. Fine. Huh. I closed the call. So that's good old Jackie. Get to the other families. Hopefully they'll give us a better reception. Yeah, so that's Jackie, who Alban Lopez has a thing with. I don't know if they're, like, romantically involved or whatever. I will repair the hull, because that noise was annoying me, firstly. And secondly, we'll need a full hull in our next fight. Hopefully... Yes, so these ship parts should definitely, I mean, I should get to a point where I can survive a fight without using ship parts and then use one ship part to repair the ship fully because this literally repaired half of it. So, repairing it during the dogfight doesn't really make sense because it's slow. I mean, it helps. It helped this time, I guess, but I used four parts, so. Hmm. All right, no fight directly either over here Cybel oh that's the uh, moon so we're at the planet now we go to the moon cutscene after cutscene it is pretty though as a space buff um, can't complain too much Cybel quick save it's allowing me to that's great Retreat. well they'll just pop up now anytime I'll go to the map and scan this planet, actually, or this moon. What do you got? 
Lots of aluminium and helium-3. Hey. Helium-3 is nice to have for our faster-than-light travel. For our grab drive. And 2,000 meters. I should probably save my boost now. I'm just quick saving like crazy because I, I know I will die a couple of times at least here and then don't want to... Hang on. It looks like we're going to be through. Yes. Repair and connect to item. Nice! Whoa. Ooh, these guys are already gone. I... I, I... We may be the three families now. And Shit. That's the last of them. Stranger, let's meet up on Lomer's ship. I'll square away payment. But I have a feeling this ain't over and there may be further paying work ahead. Okay. Okay, Lopez. When satellite is unavailable. But we can always head back to the planet. Ooh, through the sun. Aurea, that's the one. Aurea, the planet, or a moon of Aurea? Which one was Lopez on? Too many names, man. Too many names. But I think the fourth family is gone. Fourth family did not make it. Nessoe, yeah, that's the one, isn't it? Aurea was a habitable planet, right? Oh yeah, I can I can actually land anywhere. <laughs> I'll be procedurally generated, but whatever. All right, um, this is not where we have to go. We have to go to Nessoe. Um, set course, travel. Just use for the map for a change. But why did it make me go around the same solar system like that? Why did it make me go to Aurea first? I wonder. Maybe there's another quest on Aurea. Alright, what is this? Family rendezvous! Travel! There's another ship going in the opposite direction. That was kind of nice to see. In the vastness of space. Banda Watchdog. Hail. Oh, I don't know. No. Hail them. Thank you for the help. You're welcome. You're most welcome. I just died like 20 times trying to save you guys. You got anything to say? Say it to Jackie. Hey, Lemare, you're Jackie, uh, aren't you? You're Le Jackie Lemare, right? And that's Lopez. And we can hail him too. I bet the spacers regret you ever came here. Huh. Okay, and where is our mission? Hail her. Let's get this over with. Alright, we're meeting on her ship, right? So we can dock probably right about now. Let us indeed get this over with. Whoop. Nice and board. Okay, do a deep save here. Someone else to do something useful. Charming as ever. First things first, I'm pretty sure the spacers got the winds. No contact with them. All of them? My god. Hmm. Shit. They were good people. And they died. Needlessly. Because we couldn't get our act together. That's rich coming from you. You've scammed me time and time again, Alden. The spacers are a threat to us all, Jackie. Mm -hmm. And that, that is the salient point. Mistakes were made, we need to get past that. What I'm proposing is a mutual defense pact, nothing else. Each of us throws in our ships, men, materials, and whatnot, enough to protect all of our asses. I wouldn't give you one solitary ounce of helium-3 if my life depended on it. The problem is, it does. I think we all need to cool off. Stranger, a word? 
Uh, I will, but that's interesting because he's asking a defense pact between the three families, which is fine against the spacers right now, but isn't that like the start of every faction like uh, United Colonies or Free Star Rangers? So in the last episode, he mentioned uh, the, them being very proud of being free and stuff. Also, this guy's name is literally Moon Man in my native tongue, Chanda Banda, which is funny to me. But yeah. All right, Alban, what do you got to say? First things first. You did an honest day's work. You deserve an honest day's pay. Thank you. Here. Wow. With heartfelt compliments. But I expect you know what's coming next. We're not military folk, and I'm not ashamed to say we are out of our depth. Mm -hmm. I'll pay you more, much more. If you can help kick the spacers out of our system for good. And coordinate our efforts to do so. Mm-hmm. I'm more than happy to help as long as you pay a lot, lot more, like you said, because I literally got more money from freaking um, Manayana back on Neon in the Astral Lounge for selling a weapon that I actually completed a couple of missions with. So is this a lower level quest? Was I supposed to come across this quest earlier? I don't know. It was a lot more work than... than um, that um, side star, that awesome side star weapon. I don't know, but I hope you pay me like five figure sums because I'll just spend them and get a, a bigger ship or parts from my current ship. All right, anyway, you are. Let's be professional. So we're not babes in the woods. Each family has a ship or two and hard men and women that can handle themselves in a firefight. Mm -hmm. But the root of the problem is, admittedly, a self inflicted injury. Mm -hmm. My family was here first. And when Liss sent other families here, perhaps I didn't take to it kindly. Might be I made an odd credit here or there at their expense. Something Lemaire especially has never let me live down. Mm -hmm. But now we need the Lemaires and the Bandas both, I reckon. How bad is the self-inflicted injury? Listen, I'm not proud of what I did. But this was my system first. Are you? Then Jackie <laughs> comes lately, arrives. And maybe it rubbed me wrong, but it's ancient history. We got to evolve or war just fuel for the spacers. I hope I can convince them. I wouldn't them. hold my breath with Jackie. But band is good folk. Well, hopefully. Mm. We need to cooperate now, but also in the future. We need a mutual defense pact. As our new mercenary commander, please talk with Band and Lemaire. Lemaire, God help us, especially we could use. Your family's got the most ships and crew by far. But if she's a lost cause, Ben and I can muddle through. Okay. Lemaire, Banda. I'll talk to Banda first, have a pleasant conversation. Then Banda's on board, then Lemaire should be easier to convince. I don't know. But I'm good at convincing, right? I'm a persuader. Hello, stranger. Your work in getting the satellites up? You've done mm -hmm. us a good turn. I know it was paying work, but a lot of mercs wouldn't even take a list contract. List. You here to talk about the defense pack? Uh, yes. Uh, but why would the people not take a list contract? List is long on ideals, but short on credits and well since. Don't get me wrong, they've got the best of intentions, but intentions alone aren't enough. <laughs> we want to organize a bake sale. Uh, Albin was hoping you'd I join. I figured he might. Mm -hmm. I mean, I agree that right now coming together makes sense, but going forward, it's hard to imagine Jackie and Albin working together for the long haul without one winding up with a knife in the back. Yeah, sure. Any advice? If you can get those stubborn mules to work together, really together, they might be able to see the sense of this defense pack going forward. I mean, I would expect Alban Lopez to go out of his way and uh, make sure that this works. It's Jackie Lemaire that's um, a question mark right now. I'm sure they can learn to cooperate. Glad you're willing to help. I'm sure they can learn to you cooperate. Say so. Yeah. Well. The bandits will join the Great. defense pack. We got one ship operational, another we can patch up. 
It's not much, but you'll have us when you need us. Great. So we're gonna have a big like four against ten sort of a sort of a fight. What are our objectives? Was why was there something optional? Oh, it's optional to get her to join. Uh huh. I mean, uh, only if you don't have the persuasion skills that I do. Which reminds me, why don't we take a look at our skills? And uh, why don't we see if we can add something to persuasion? I think we should be. Yeah, we can add something to persuasion. So if this doesn't work, we can do that. I also want, yes, I want this so bad, so bad. Um, but I also want this so bad, space with design. Uh, and weapon engineering. And whatever this is, chemistry. I don't know. <laughs> All sciencey things. Payloads. We need to make 10 graph jumps with 75 or more percent maximum cargo capacity. I mean, that's not going to be hard at all to unlock level 2. Uh, ballistic weapon systems. 20% increased damage and recharge 15% faster. Target control systems. Time to lock onto enemy ships is reduced. And targets fire at you 25% lower. Security. This is lock picking. Piloting. Unlock the ability. It's available. Yes. And I do have a... Wait, what? I, I, can, I can do this, right? No, I don't have a skill point at the moment. I spent it. What did I spend it on? Thought I had a skill point available. What? Huh. Oh well. Okie dokie. Jacqueline the Just so you know, Albin is a con man and a thief. Mm -hmm. Associating with the likes of him reflects poorly on your character. Mm-hmm. What did he do? When my crew first arrived, Albin was all charm and eager to deal. It seemed like the start of a fruitful relationship. But quickly it became clear that he was grifting us. Machines we bought broke down, shipments he hauled for us went missing, and help he promised never materialized. I mm. swore I'd never work with him again. Oh, he's lucky I'm not mm -hmm. a vengeful woman. Yeah, this is straight to the point. I don't like him either, but this defense pack is the best chance. He's played me straight so far. This won't work well. This is just Severo talking about himself and his work here, but I think this is the right thing to do at this point. Don't be so certain. So here's the deal. Odds are good my crew can hold out against the spacers all by ourselves. If we're going to band together, I have the most to contribute and the most to lose. The smart play for my interests is the Lemaire's hunker down and outlast the storm. Hmm... 2,000 credits, that's kind of cheap, but considering, like, we got 2,500 uh, from uh, freaking Alban over there for the whole, like, fight. I guess these guys live in a different economical econ economical zone. But I'm going to persuade you. I may you. not be some sort of military expert, but you can't know that for certain. Mm-hmm. We've got five, uh, and we've got f two options with four. <laughs> it's gonna be an adventure of a lifetime. Join us. You know, joining the defense pack is right. I think she would be somebody who would, um, you know, her morals, you know, her moral side should make her agree with us. Do I? It's not that simple. No. Okay. A Banda Lopez alliance without you will affect your interest on the They're road? small time, even together. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. This is not going so well. I'm, I'm letting you guys know I'm going to reload if this doesn't work, but I'm going to do six. Huh. How'd you get so damn cocky? Uh-huh. Well, you might have a point. <laughs> Adventure of a lifetime? Really? Nice. That worked? Let Albin know that I'm willing to try this defense pack for now. Really? So that's what worked? After, like, calling to her moral self Defense and shit? Gather. 
Not only can we deal with the yeah, current yeah, yeah, yeah. problem, but future ones as well. So is the defense packed in business? Yes, it is. Come on, don't keep. I even got Jackie on board. Despite all the terrible things you did to her, Jackie will help us. I will say that. Well, she has every right to hold a grudge. But she's joining us anyway? Yes, she is, but you know How you were an ass to her, right? Did you manage that? I'd rather talk about what's Let's next. get right into it then. So, the sensors have picked up two contact groups. Undoubtedly our spacer friends. Mm -hmm. We don't have many ships, but we can send them with you. Okay. Or hold them in reserves, your call. Any details? Expect more than you encountered at the satellites. How much more? Mm. Hard to say at this distance. Okay. I mean... Send the ships you can. You I could it. use some help. I'll send a long word. After you deal with the spacers, meet back on my farm. I've got an idea how to find where the spacers are based. Okay. We Okay, so there will be a follow-up quest after this where we find the spacer's base. And Working more closely together is something I've been for from the beginning. Uh -huh. Let's get back into Any adventure you can fly away from. How have you been? Is, is that how the saying goes? I'm good, Lynn. How are you? Um, do we have anything? On research? Blocked, completed, block. I mean, I guess I will have to. Ooh. Fiber. Wait, what? Discover how to prepare alien tonic, yellow giant splash, and boba tea. Boba alien tea. Outpost development don't want. This is blocked. Weaponry. Ooh, optics and laser mods. Chlorosilanes. Chlorosilanes. Sealants should not be in my... No, I, I don't want silanes to be selected. Oh, man. I want uh, chlorosilanes to be selected. Oh, we have chlorosilanes. Great. Okay, awesome. Great, we've got laser mods, and everything is blocked again. So for this, we will require a skill point or two before we can uh, make these uh, new mods. But I think next time I'm at, um, what is it called, a weapons bench? I will check it out. All right, for now, the big question is, well, we do undock, but then should we go after this quest right away? I think we can. I think there's two stations and maybe do a deep save. And uh, there's two stations of these uh, fuckers. And we can go check them out. What are these? These are probably friendlies. These light blue arrows. Light blue arrows. I'm slurring. Sorry. Dionysus, let's do it. And Mitra, I think the other planet of me is called. Okay. Is it? Whoa. Whoa, that's a lot of them. That's a lot of them. One, two, three, four, five. Five of them. Who that? Who there? Ah, that's. Okay, so there's four of them. And. Lock, 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 and shoot. All right. Thrusters. Up, up, and go. One. 
It's great that their fire is not concentrated all on me, eh? That kind of helps. Now one of them is firing. Alright, raccoon. Go. Shield offline. I'll repair. Required. Repairing Sarah's hull. Get away from me. E okay. Come on. Come on. There we go. And I'm, I'm confusing my thrusters with my boosters. And uh, maneuverability is suffering. But. There. There. That's three. That is the third. And you are number four, mister. Boom. And there. Yes, please. Space wow, hello. That was wow. Whoa. Some good fly in there. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Let's go grab some loot. Um how many um, thingamabobs did I use? Cargo hold? That's always a good, um... I used two, because I had five at the end of the last thing, and we got two ship parts from the other ship. So, I did well. Iridium, Neodymium, no rheostat. No thank you. And the other one? It's quite far away. Analysis, no. Watchdog, no. Spacer Raccoon. I'm gonna loot every single one of these. Hopefully we get five ship parts or something. That would be nice. My hull's at like 80%. Hmm, 75, 80, 80 rather. Lithium. Raw materials are fine, I would say. Control rod, no sir. What about this guy? No. Rheostat. Okay, so this is the one we already checked, and now the fourth one. I think I can maybe even fight in third person mode, eh? The next uh, battle. That'll be an interesting change of uh, perspective. Uh, Magnon conductor as a centered magnet. Fuck you. Where are the ship parts? There's literally. These are literally floating here. Mithras. Let's go. Uh oh, amongst it already. Lock it, lock it, lock it, lock it. Yeah. Time to die. Yeah. Mine's do it, Abbas. Okay, I'm gonna trash talk to them in German. I don't know why. I just feel like speaking it. Ah. Damn it. Drive is out. Oh shit. Losing one chip part. Just one. Come on, yes. Numero uno. Or number eins. Alright. Yes. Two, and we are a hundred and hundred on our hull and shields. Looking good. Just need to recharge the missiles. Honestly. Pretty 
critical hit. There we go. Skill point. Yeah, yeah. Took some damage here, but we're clear. Lopez wants to meet back at the farm. So, thanks. Nice, dude. That that was quick. I mean, when they're not all firing at you, it's rather nice. Credits and lead. That's some heavy shit. That's some heavy metal going on over there. Um, isocentric, super cool. Fuck off. It's far away. Far away. But you, dude. Also far away, but kind of towards each other. We'll go with this one first. Okay, ship's looking 100%. I think I just used one. Let's see quickly. Yes, just one. Got four left. So a few episodes ago, we were struggling with uh, med packs, and now we're struggling with med packs for our ship, aka ship parts. Tantalum, semi metal wafer, no sir. Yes, one ship part. Very nice. Back at five ship parts now. Alright. This should be the last one. I think that one on the right there we've already explored. It's got shitty shit in it. Ship parts! Beryllium and credits. I will lick that plate clean. <laughs> that was a good haul. Lopez Watchdog. Oh, Lopez Watchdog is dead? What? Well, I mean, I'm sorry, but I'm gonna loot that. Maybe you have some more ship parts. Is that gonna, like, change the story a little bit? I don't think so. I don't think this is that, that kind of game. Ah, oh, I already did loot it. This was the first thing I looted, and I picked up a thing I didn't need. Okay, good. Orea. First Orea and then to its moon, Nessoe. Oh no, the farm was on Orea, I think, yeah. Alright. Let's see. That's Orea. Open planet map. And land right about here. Okay, so this quest started, I mean, I found it in my quest log. I don't even know where I picked it up. It was some NPC chatter or what was it? But this was an interesting, like, space family themed sort of a story. I liked it. Let's see what happens now, though. The story part is still to come. Can Perhaps they coexist? not the sort of place on which one would settle down. Satisfied. Shut up, Vasco. God damn it. What is that sound? Okay, I uh, will keep my... Orion, why not? Let's keep our laser rifle with us. Speaking of, I'm gonna take another look at... Piloting, we can we can do this. We can actually make a frontier class B. I don't know about buying a ship yet that's class B, but okay. We need okay. So I put one one more point in medicine, right? So they will heal me faster, sort of thing. Increase ja uh, increase craft jump range. Resources required to craft items is decreased. Once I have one more here, then I can do space suit design, which is what I'll, and weapons engineering. So that's important too. Uh, I'm, I feel like I can't decide at the moment. This would be nice too. I mean, pickpocketing. Rifle certification is what I would also want over here. Yeah, this one, 10% more damage. 
Um, this one I still need to complete a challenge, right? Yeah. I mean, I want to just go till here and... Yeah. Um, I don't know. I, 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 don't, I don't really know what I want to spend my skill point on. Maybe we'll just uh, get a couple of more and then we'll be in a better position to decide what to go for. Give me that loot. This is not theft, right? Because there is no marker. Oh, well, you jumped over the counter. It's a fancy old looking computer. What kind of keyboard do you have? Of course you have a QWERTY keyboard. And you have... This is a weird button. And you have control on the outside, so it's kind of like a Windows keyboard, not a Mac keyboard. Interesting. Okay. Lockers. I will loot everything, man. Neon socialite skirt. Is that going to be a separate clothing item? Ah, it's a whole top and skirt situation. Okay. Plus 502 recovery. I will actually put that on as my casual suit because... Um, why is it? Ah, it's new, right? That's why. And spacesuit. So hide spacesuit and settlements so that Severo can look... No, I want, to, want it to be hidden. It's a bit confusing the way this is shown here. I can't change that. I think I will keep it. Hide space shoot and sh in settlements, yeah. Could be. This isn't a settlement, so I guess. I mean, plus we're, we're not even outside of the airlock. Um, okay, now that we've looted around here, let's go talk to these guys. Juan Lopez. Glad to hear you're back. Safe and sound. Banda, you owe me 30 credits. You're tougher than I thought. Easy right. money. So while you were doing that, I used the communication satellites to triangulate some spaces chatter. You did what? I'm more than just a pretty face. Anyway, there's an old derelict star station the spacers are using as a base. Mmm. Are you sure about I mean, this? There's a real outside chance there's a relay or something there, but these spacers aren't the most savvy of customers. I'm telling you, that's where they're holed up. A relay? Are we talking like Mass Effect relays? Like mass relays? What? What? Is this a tie-in? I don't think so, but then that's we need to send every ship we got. I mean, I think at this point. Somebody will die, right? Or somebody will not be happy because of casualties, a.k.a. Lemaire. Jackie Lemaire won't be happy, but I guess that's the price we'll have to pay. But I'm not going in there. Ship fighting, I'm not doing alone. But if we're going to go on ground and take them out, then sure. Couldn't say it better myself. There are undoubtedly a lot of spacers there, both ships and men on the station itself. Mm -hmm. We need to excise this cancer from our system. Every last one of them. That's the spirit. 100% agree. So, oh glorious leader, <laughs> any words of wisdom or inspiration before we embark? Severo Obarca, before he goes to battle, would howl like a wolf and be smelly as fuck. But... If you want to speech that extra, that's extra. First and foremost, be careful. I know you're tough, but the spacers mean business. You've lived under the threat of these spacers too long. Victory is in sight. Uh, yeah, these spacers mean business. So caution's the word of the day. Got it. Yes, don't we lose your lives. We everything we got to bear. There won't be any do-overs on this one. Mm-hmm. We'll all be waiting for you to jump in. Great. 
That's awesome. Okay, so let me see why he does not have his helmet on. Show helmet. In breathable space. So this is a breathable area and they're just wearing helmets. Is that it? Then what about the suit? Why aren't you... Sh game, why are you doing this to me? Why are you triggering my OCD? Hide. And I will click... Hide. Now it's on again. Okay. I have no idea. All right. Let's get out of here. Into the ship. And we go to this freaking relay, man. Like, what the hell? Hang on. Uh, no, Vasco doesn't have anything. Let's go to the cockpit. Find the interior of this ship comforting. Yeah, Andresia will probably have to be replaced with either Sarah or Barrett. Or even Sam Cole. I think I want to get to know Sam Cole better, especially if we're going to be doing Freestar Ranger shit in the future episodes. Uh-oh, what? Why is there fighting music happening? Okay, deep save time. And let's take a look at the map. Thanatos. Where is this place? Oh, right here. Star Station. Oh, this is the place with the cryolab. Interesting. Set course. No. Star Station, yeah, set course. There's gonna be zero G battling again, one of all oh, shit. Time to die. Ah, here we go. Okay. Let's start locking you in. Camo, camo. Alright. And there we go, there we go. Coyote, sorry. There you go. And cluster time. Is that a bogey? It is, right? Yeah. and a hundred. Missile launchers are, are still dead. Probably just get him with the ballistic and the electromagnetic on this one. Alright. Again. Okay. One ballistic. Oh, sorry. One uh, missile. And that was enough. There we go. And Mr. Fourth ship. Last ship. There we go. Critical hit on the reactor. Look alive. Spacer's got oh, reinforcements. Second wave. Alright. Let's do it. Ah, now they're attacking us. You, Raven. Yep, there we 
go. I uh, haven't used any sh uh, any um, what are those called? Space parts. Ship parts. <laughs> yeah, space parts. Okay, back. Time to repair now. Can also take a breather, hopefully. Stir up his back. That he can't shoot at me. Charging, missiles firing, twice. All right, this one's almost done. Ah, there we go. Get the fuck out of here. And thrusters down. Boost away. Shield is offline, hull is getting damaged, missiles are being locked on, not looking very good. Looks like we're alone out here now, huh? All of their ships were, ships were destroyed. Our friends are gone. Damn. Yeah? You think so? Spacers, man, I swear. I should have destroyed my ship too, but... Okay. Repair the hull. Get the shield up. Coyote can wait. Coyote is going further away, which is a good thing. One more repair job. Still close up there. Like a last it's time to reclaim this system for good. Whew, that was heavy. Let's grab this loot first, dude. Zero wire, cobalt. I'll take the cobalt, fuck the rest. We destroyed a bunch of ships here. This one's a bit further away. Um, credit, sure. No thank you to Zero Gimbal. Whoa, those are a lot of ships. Swiss Raven. Let's grab these. We did pretty okay, I think. I mean, if I can quickly look at my space bar uh, ship parts. Three? We used three, I think. Yeah. At the end of the last uh, battle. Come on, come on, come on. Let's do it. Ah, uh, disappointing. Calm relay adaptive frame. Fuck. Scarab, and then there are these two more. Tau grade rheostat, fuck that. Hypnos, no. Ah, oh, Banda. Poor Banda. Banda ship is gone. And these me with some credits, good. Lopez watchdog is gone, leaves me with some credits, good. What is that? Space of Raven. I think we've seen these, right? So many of them. I'm sure there's a couple we haven't seen. <clears throat> the vastness of space. I mean, we're literally going at a few meters per second right now. Like, it's not super fast, our speed. Which we can do something about, actually. There we go. Just 
GOG gimbal, we've seen that. Coyote. Take a look at the Coyote. Ice Age Magnet, no. We've seen all of these, right? Retrofied Star Station. Okay, we're gonna hit, uh, go right around and stop here because. Pardon? Okay. I'm gonna take the lock away from that. Clear the spaces. What? Oh, that was the targeting mode, right? Because I think we've run out of time here. I just wanted to take a good look at Severo. Se Mr. Severo. Mr. Conqueror of <laughs> Space Battles and liberator of the list people but that will have to be it for this episode unfortunately we'll start off and we'll kick some ass on this uh, star station in the next episode thanks so much for watching like comment subscribe hit that bell and i will catch you in the next episode see ya